welcoming me to uh, LA. Uh, I just got in about uh, two days ago from Israel. Uh, so I have uh, you know, some experience in the current situation. Um, just a little bit about myself really quickly. I'm originally from Virginia, the whole other side of the country. And uh, after I finished college, uh, I'm, I went to the University of North Carolina and uh, with Vince Carter. Vince Carter, Vince Carter, we're freshmen together. We're freshmen together. He remembers me. Probably not. Probably not. Anyway, so uh, after college, I, I moved to Israel and I was in yeshiva and then uh, in the old city of Jerusalem. And then I was in the army and then I was back in yeshiva in Jerusalem in the old city. And then I was. Um, I went to be a rabbi on campus back in North Carolina for a few years, for a few semesters, so we did by semesters. Um, we stayed, we really still lived in Israel, but we would go to the semesters in the university. And uh, after we finished that, about uh, five years ago, we were back in Israel full time. Now I run a place in the old city called the Jerusalem Heritage House, where we host uh, students, travelers, and lone soldiers. And uh, we try to give them as much Judaism and love as we can. And uh, it's a really rewarding uh, profession. I'm very happy. It also does require me to come to America to fundraise. So that's uh, why I'm here now. But I also thought it would be important to speak about the situation of what's going on, because I know American Jewish people uh, care very much. Um, but with the media and this, that, and the other, it can be kind of hard to get a real picture of what's going on. So I thought if I can help with that, so, the, so, I, so I will. So. Um, just before I uh, get into the situation in Israel, um, I lectured at Asia Torah in the Old City and uh, a few other programs about current events in Israel. So I, I try to stay on top of things to the best of my ability. 